Hello, ladies, and thank you all for coming. Of course, I wouldn't miss this for anything. I agree. This is nice. Especially when we get to celebrate each other. For sure, as mothers, we do so much, and I thought it would be nice to honor all we do in the form of a meal and good company. Wonderful idea, little sister. You're so full of them. Thank you, Renee. I'm so sorry I'm late, Sandra. I had to drop Cammy off, and of course she was taking forever, which made me late. Oh, please. We've all been there before. And don't worry, you didn't miss a thing. The food hasn't even come yet. Take your seat and just relax. Thank you so much, Sandra. I really appreciate your understanding. Wait, I thought you were going to cook for us. That was my original intention, but Tony insisted that we have it catered. That way, I wouldn't be working in the kitchen. The man have a point. The purpose is to celebrate, not slave in the kitchen. You're right about that. That Tony is a good man. I have to agree with you on that. He is very good to me. Mommy, we're sorry to interrupt your brunch, but we wanted to say something to you all. It's fine, my love. What did you want to say? So, each of you women are all mothers celebrating each other and all the work you put into your children and families. Even though some of you might not be our actual mothers, you play such a huge role in our lives. We wanted to do something nice for you to thank you. We have these cards for you all because the roles you've played in our lives have been so influential. Oh my goodness, girls. This is so unexpected. Thank you, my loves. You're, you're going to bring me to tears. Well, you all deserve it. Miss Kathy, I want to thank you for showing me how to love big despite a person's downfalls. And Aunt Renee, I appreciate how much you're willing to protect your loved ones. Miss Sandra, the way you nurture your family is like really inspiring. Miss Naomi, though you're new to the group, your ability to remain so fashionable and elegant while raising two little ones is pretty amazing. So thank you for being that role model for us. We could go on and on, but mostly everything is in these cards. Yeah, everything's in there. Read them whenever you get a chance. All right, we'll let you get back to your brunch. Thanks again for allowing us to interrupt. That is so sweet of those girls and to say all those kind things. I wasn't expecting any of that, but they make a strong point. True, we aren't only mothers to our children, but our community of children. I must say, I am so grateful to have you ladies and your children in my daughter's life. That cameo of mine can sure be a spitfire, but Diamond is always there to help guide her down the right path. Thank you, Heather. But to be honest with you, Cammy brings great value to Diamond's life. She's always challenging her and pushing her to do something she normally wouldn't. I so agree. Naomi, your daughter Nephi is such a doll and Hazel just adores her. She really needed a friend who was a girl. Plus, her calm ways are so helpful in slowing down my fast-talking Hazel. That Hazel sure does talk fast. Mm-hmm. She really does. And thank you, Renee. Nephi is very happy to have Hazel as a friend. I can see she thrives off her confidence, which I know comes from you. On a personal note, it feels really good to be accepted among your group of women and be a part of your community. That's very sweet of you, Naomi. We are glad to have you. Indeed. I love how Zen and Lucky help push and encourage each other academically. They really do, but it comes from a place of wanting the best for each other. Oh, and that Gianna? She is so bold and assured of herself. All the kids could benefit from that. That's a beautiful way of looking at it. I very rarely see it from that angle, though I love her for exactly who she is. I have to say, as mothers working so hard every day, sometimes you question if your kids really love and appreciate you. It's so true. It's moments like this that make all the hard work worth it. I couldn't agree more. We truly have some amazing children. I think that's Tony with the food. I don't know about you ladies, but I'm ready to eat. Remember to tell your mother how much you love and appreciate everything she does for you. Happy Mother's Day to all you mothers out there. 
You are truly blessed and loved. She is clothed with strength and dignity. She can laugh at the days to come. She speaks with wisdom and faithful instruction is on her tongue. She watches over the fears of her household and does not eat the bread of idleness. Her children arise and call her blessed, her husband also, and he praises her. Many women do noble things, but you surpass them all. Charm is deceptive and beauty is fleeting, but a woman who fears the Lord is to be praised. Honor her for all that her hands have done, and let her works bring praise at the city gate. Proverbs chapter 31 verses 25 through 31.